Okay, I just want to do this quick video because it's the first one. I know I was like the only one in my county to find it and get it. Um, it's the Viking 12 volt slash 24 volt jump starter. 3400 peak amps. Let's see. I'm not going to do like a a jump start test we all know it will jump unless I can find a semi which my old boss does and we could try it but uh, let me go over the jump box itself do tests I will flash the voltage in 100% um, the light you hold down for like five seconds. It says three in the manual ends up being like five seconds. It's got a couple different ones. Pretty bright. That's to turn on the USB. If you tap it. Cigarette lighter. This does not... There's a 1224. Let's see, we'll do this. See, yeah, it has the switch for 12. I have to switch. For semis or buses. So, remember 24 volts. It's the back of it. This one does not have a compressor. Different style charging plug. What I do like about these is both positive and negative. Look at the wire in there. To connect both sides so you get a good connection. Because a lot of them don't. They only have one side. And you don't get a good connection on the jump start. Just came out with these. Not even on the shelf. The one that I got was still in the box from the back. They grabbed it and it just came off the truck. V8 diesel says air V12 gas. Any weather condition? Here's the back of it. Pause right there for a second. So if you want to pause on anything. Two uh, 22,000 milliamp batteries in there. And that's it. Those are the jumps. I was going to get the small. I went to get the smaller one even without the compressor because I already have a compressor. But there was like a sticker on the shelf next to the, it's like a bluish color one. The one that's like these, that's 1700 cranking amps with, without the compressor. I was going to get that, but I seen this and I do towing and I get paid for jump starts. So this will end up paying for itself. So... They're two ninety nine. It's quite a bit for what it is, but I use the new Harbor Freight credit card, and I got ten percent off. So it was like two sixty nine or something like that, two sixty five. So it wasn't too bad, and it ended up paying for itself, and I'll get my money back and then some. And I noticed a lot of people don't know. I guess they just return them or whatever. But you just take the screws off that are holding it and there's batteries so you can just replace the batteries you don't once the jump pack dies you can just replace the batteries but i stay on top of my charging charge every time after it's been used or like they say even 30 months or every couple weeks just throw it on the charger because it makes me money so gotta keep it good Check them out. This is going to be the first video on YouTube of the Viking 3400 peak amp jump box from Harbor Freight.